Alta does not currently have the ability to print a patient's entire electronic health record. To create a single patient record, patient administration department personnel must pull from multiple Alta modules, which could take several hours to complete. The Alta Web Print AWP project allows the printing of a patient's entire EHR in one report. At this time, AWP is only available for PAD personnel. Once a patient is selected in Alta, AWP allows the user to select from the following date, range, and multiple clinical domains. AWP options include printing of address labels, print hard copy or PDF, and the ability to prioritize query. Alta Print will be accessible and visible within the patient's electronic health record. Let's first click Search to locate our patient. Let's enter our patient's name in the last name and first name fields, then click Find. Select the patient that you're searching for and then click OK. You will now notice that Alta Print is available in the patient's EHR. At the Alta Print Request Report window, there are several parameters to choose from. These selections are based on the provider's preferences. We can select Date Range, Include Clinical Domains, Information Sensitivity, Select Printer, Mailing, Request Report, Status Page, and Prioritize Request. Let's make our selection and then run our report. To change the defaulted date, click the drop-down arrow to display the calendar and change the dates. For this training material, we are going to keep the All default. For this example, we are going to uncheck the clinical domains that I do not want printed on this report. Procedures, Family History, Immunizations, and Clinical Notes. You can choose to include sensitive and non-sensitive information. If you choose to include sensitive information, you will be audited. For this example, we will check both items. Click the drop-down arrow and select your printer options, Default Printer or the PDF Output Folder. Select your desired printer. If the default printer is selected, the document will print in a hard copy format. If you choose the PDF Output Folder, the file will go directly to the PDF Shared Drive. If your hard copy document needs to be sent to another location, i.e. a doctor's office, work location, etc., first click the down arrow, place a check mark next to Generate Mailing Instructions, and then enter the desired information. Ensure you are aware of encryption, PHI, and PII local and federal policies when sending data. The parameters have been entered, so click the Request Report button. As previously noted, when you select to include sensitive data, a window will open letting you know that you will be audited and ask if you would like to proceed. If you select No, the report will not print and you will not be audited. For this example, we will select Yes. Notice the patient's report is still in a waiting status. To check the status, press the Refresh List button. The print job may take several minutes to complete. Notice the report has now changed to finished. To view the report, access the print server and locate your PDF. Here is a copy of your report. Each report will contain a table of contents, demographics. Please note that we did not select a category for demographics. However, this section automatically prints for every report requested. Allergies. 
and everything else based on the selected parameters. The bottom of each page contains this information. Patient's name, date of birth, last four digits of the sponsor's social security number, date created. This document is subject to the Privacy Act of 1974, for official use only, and a page number. We've just easily completed running a report. Simple steps on how to use the Alta Print feature. Please contact your MTF's local help desk or contact DISA if you receive an exception log or any additional Alta Print issues that may arise.